So uh, I'm here at the Jomo Kenyatta Airport. And, uh, no, no, it's my other bag. Uh, drinking tea. Look at this. Drinking some tea. It's got lemon in it. But it's my own creation. Fucking oh, loud, man. I don't these people. They were quiet a while ago. The tea I have is my own creation because just stepped on a roach. Um, smooth move, organic tea, right? I put that in with uh, this uh, pure Kenyan black tea. See that? There you go. That's what I'm drinking right now. And that's what I'm waiting because I got a little few hours, of the, about four hours before uh, I catch the flight to uh, Cape Town. Uh, but uh, so I got this book. Well, this is for uh, Shebby. I got it for him. Well, as a fact, you know, Oh, no way. I think I might gift it to him. I'm not sure what's going to happen. It costs a lot of money, actually. Really good book, though. But look at this. Before I get, let me go backwards. Uh, take my glasses off so I can read, right? Uh, it's got some credits here in the background. There's some pictures before. Come on, man. Oh, African, uh, African social theorist. Right there. This cat here. This is uh, Leopold Senghor, very, very, he's the, he's the one that dealt with uh, the poets and, and uh, well, Negro Two, he's the one that, and his group uh, did the whole Negro Two thing, uh, North Africa, that kind of thing. But uh, they have some people here, I want to cite them. Uh, Amar Cezaire, uh, who was a professor and social theorist of uh, co-founder of the concept of Negro Two, he's one of those two. Uh, from, he's from Martinique. That, uh, uh, that's Fernand was from, and also the oh the sister that the, the first sister that had a Holly, major Hollywood studio uh, backer, uh, uh, not Sugar King, not, she did Sugar Cane Alley, which is what I know her from. It's like the story of me and my grandmother. We're going to get to that now. Uh, but do you think, I think it's uh, uh, Cole White, something with White in it. You know, you know it's, it's really good. Oh, Marlon Brando was in it too. Uh, 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 Basil Davidson, professor and journalist and associate from Great Britain, provided a colossal uh, body of research about African civilizations and free uh, That's what he did. Oh, Sheikh Ante Diop, the man. Hey, that's what you say, the man. That's it. Boom. Sheikh Ante Diop, the man. You don't go to with the legend, but the man. Professor Brad, Sheikh Ante Diop, you should know him. Um, he was born in, in, uh, 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 born like a, in Sudan, you know, Sudanese, Egyptian kind of heritage. You know. Uh, uh, Dr. Ali Bouzour, I know him. Uh, oh, from Kenya. Okay. So, oh, and here you have uh, Dr. Louis Leakey. Picture of him. A picture of the doctor. Dr. Louis Leakey. Now, he's the one that, uh, that, that found the, uh, that demonstrated that life began in Kenya. Uh, uh, you know, with Lucy, whatever have you. Hey, I talked to his son. I met his son, Richard Leakey. Anyway. Time to shook his hand. So it's a great book. It's got a lot of pictures in it. Hey, this is like a great for school. It's got some really interesting uh, photos. I'm not going to go to the whole book. You should buy it. I guess, you know, look at the next one. It's the Jubilee. I don't know if you can see that over there. Well, let me get to some, something else because I'm going to talk about something else. So anyway, so it's a really good book. But it has a forward by um, Randy Weston. Oh. That's the man also, like musician man. You know, the you know, tall brother, you know, the man, you know, um, I think it's Moroccan uh, lineage or something like that. I go put sugar in the fly. Uh, but it's this short thing I want to read to you. Like what he says. The music is so varied that we have no real idea what African music is. I do know this though, when an African touches an instrument, whether that African is an extension like Louis Armstrong or master healer from Morocco or Mississippi, that instrument becomes an African instrument. You got that? In other words, what Randy Weston was saying is that when a, when, a, when a black American picks up an instrument, right, it instantly becomes an African instrument. Okay. When a person is touched by African music, 
uh, from his skin to his soul, that person has become Africanized. Perhaps this is the true meaning of universal, something foreign that remains, that, re, uh, that reminds you of your deepest self. Right. Dr. Tam, that's, that's the guy that wrote this book, uh, Pascal Bakar Tayan. I'm saying Tayan, Tom pronouncing it. Uh, uh, has made a major contribution, and this book should be in every school and home. I believe that. Okay, so we got that. Now, so I'm in the airport. I'm, 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 I'm just breezing, breezing through the book because you know I'm, I got to give it up to Sheppy when I get. <laughs> I think I'm, I'm staying at Sheppy's place. Maybe I'll maybe I'll breeze a little bit more breezing through it. I got like four hours. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna Four four. Yeah, four hours. Um, maybe five hours. I don't know. Um, but the, 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 the airplane ride was kind of interesting. The reason I'm picking this tea and put my smooth move in there because, you know, the airport, I don't really eat the, the food, but I do taste a little bit of whatever that, you know. And I don't want to be stopped up. And I had, to, I had some bread and whatever, so I got to regulate my body because, you know, if you get constipated, you're full of it. That's not good. It's probably raise your blood pressure too. I should think about that. Keep myself regular. I would drink a lot of water. See, I got my water. Water thing with my purifying stone there. Oh, this is uh, going to be interesting. I got this water from the bathroom. I ain't buying no water, right? And so this, this means this is real Kenyan water. Uh -huh. so, so I've been taking pictures to get these. Uh, or maybe I should show you that you can see right there the zebra and some. I don't know if y'all can see that. I hope y'all can see that. I hope y'all can see that. Uh, uh, so, you know, I'm, I'm playing the tourists, you know? And this thing, they take some dollars. I only got $5 left. I have $5 left. I have to change it. Put my wrap in my bag. Because I always wrap my bag, you know, in that plastic thing. Of course, well, I it's don't like to get damaged or whatever have you. I've had that bag for a long time since I started traveling. Like, I have my bag since 95. Well, maybe before then. Yeah, since 95 at least. Right? 1995 at least. Anyway, it was, it was kind of interesting at the airport. This is not like, this is the airport. You, you, you think of every you think of American airports, blah, 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 whatever you think. Or European airports or Saudi airports or whatever it is. But this is a little, you know, like they had the X-ray machine. But it ain't working. <laughs> it's crazy. It's not working. Uh, uh, and I have to worry about going through the scanner thing because they have a scanner there, but it ain't working either. Because I I don't do the scan thing. I always get the, the you know, gotta pat me down, right? And uh, that's why boys, that's why I come really early to have a I think it annoys those guys. But what can I say? Uh, what else? What else can I tell you? So I'm, I'm not gonna. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just wasting time. I, I, I'm not, not your time. Hopefully, you know? I'm just, I'm biding my time. You know, and uh, they give the tea in it, like they do in European. They give you the tea in the little thing. Put this bag right in here too. Get that there too. Why not? Well, have some more tea. I'll drink the whole thing. Take my time. Put lemon in there. I like the lemon. Actually, lemon is really mine. So that's uh, that's travel etiquette for you. Oh, they give you, oh also they give you tickets up there. They give you you know how they, they give you a little pack you know when you travel internationally because they have to uh, what do you say? Uh, no, you you you. Well, I'll show you the pack. I like this though. This is a nice little pouch. Oh, I think it's just I got a side thing here I didn't see. Let's see what's in the side. Let's see what's in the side. Anything in the side thing? No. I don't know. I like it, right? Let's see what's in it. Right? Oh, I read it. They got, a, they got the toothbrush and toothpaste. I like that fold. I like the fold too. This is like a soft bristle one too. You want soft. You don't want hard. You rip up your gum. You know, they got some toothpaste in there, but well, I have to use that. Get the earplugs out and use them. my head, head, headphones on. You know the headphones is good to play because you don't hear that that that, that sound. You know, because I guess it's noise cancellation. But I can listen to you know listen to stuff. In fact, I was listening to Mr. Dilly Ford Jr. on the way. You know, 
so because I, I downloaded it, then I listened to it later. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is something I can use. Oh, let's look at what this is. Hey, look at that. It's a comb and a brush. Look at that. Oh, yeah. I like this. It's the first time I got something like this. The other packs, like Emirates or something like they don't give you stuff like this. Wow. Gotta use it. I ain't got no mustache for Oh, this is good. I like this. Hey, can you add? Me and you. It's tight. Two pieces of oh, oh, yeah, then you got the socks that you wear. You know, the thing. They gave it to me after it was given off the plane, so I don't know what that means. And uh, one of those things that you know, sort of black out. Oh, and a pen. Always useful. Well, there you go. I like this pack. It's the best pack I've had in my travels. Better get ready. I travel so long ago. Well, not for me. Maybe they upgraded stuff now. Throw the stuff back in. I don't need the airplug things. I'm going to throw those away. I'll see what happens. Okay. So anyway, I've talked enough. I'll let you all do, it. do what you all do. Whatever you all do. It's there. I think it's Thursday? Yeah, Thursday. The 11th. It's Veterans Day in the United States. Hey, to the veterans. You know, being a veteran. Anyway, you take care. I'm just giving you a well, This has been me, T, from the Patterson Secret of Trains to Go. Let you know what I only suspect. From, from Kenya. Well, from Jomo Kenyatta Airport, Kenya. Uh, I guess I could go outside. No, uh, you know, with this whole thing with the ding, the ding, the ding, uh, you know, I guess you should go outside because you might not get back in, you know. They might say, hey, you've been outside. You may have that COVID, that, that, um, uh, you know, that, that, that test that you got, you know, may not be good. Anyway, talk to you later.